Hello there, Kristen Corpos here talking about insurance. Now that you've read my article, you're probably wondering where do I get this insurance? And that's a great question. So equipment insurance, general liability insurance, and errors and omissions coverage, as well as property insurance can be found through several companies. In my opinion, the most popular place for photographers to go for insurance is Hill and Usher. And they've, they've had a table at WPPI each year, seem like really nice people, and seem to be an all around favor in the industry. So Hill and Usher is the agent, and they offer something called Package Choice. And that's a coverage that they put together specifically for photographers, videographers, graphic artists, web designers, and more. So if you go to packagechoice.com, you can get more information and you can even submit for a quote for specifically your needs. The insurance itself is underwritten through the Hartford. So the policy itself is going to say the Hartford, that's the insurance company. So how do you get it? That's the big question, right? So get in touch with Hill and Usher, you know, give them a call, go online. The whole thing is super easy. When I originally signed up with them, I had insurance within a matter of days and they made it really, really simple. So the cost is going to vary um, depending on where you're located and the amount of equipment that you're insuring. So I would say expect costs to range from around $400 to $900 for the average photographer. And this is really just a ballpark figure just trying to give you an average. Personally, when I was living within one mile from the ocean, I had 25K in gear, my cost was nearly $800 per year. But like I said, you can definitely pay this quarterly, which makes the burden a little easier to take. Now, there are other insurance companies that also offer coverage, like State Farm, for example. And I don't personally have experience with any of these other companies, but I want you to know that there are options. So if you have an insurance agent, give them a call, ask them what your options are, as a photography business owner, you know, since you already have insurance through them and they may have more information for you. If you are a member of PPA or you are becoming one, they have insurance options as well. So a membership to PPA is $323 per year and the benefits go far beyond insurance. They have something like 30,000 members, so there's a lot of other benefits that they can give you. But check out their website for information as to what you get as a member. Equipment coverage called photo care is including your membership, and this covers up to 15,000 in equipment, but you have to opt into it. It's not automatic when you get membership. I think you just opt in online, you know, you send a few forms of information, and it wasn't that hard, but I did have to do something. You can also upgrade your coverage to photo care, plus, which provides some extra greater coverage or advantages, so that may be worth exploring. Please note that photo care is just for equipment protection only. You can get liability coverage through PPA as well, and more information is available on their website regarding that. And also be sure to read about their indemnification trust, which is actually like an errors and emissions type of coverage, and that comes free with your membership, so that's a huge advantage as well. So read more about that. That was a lot of information, so I'd like to just leave it there. I hope this information about insurance was really helpful for you, and thank you for watching my video.